Hey everyone, it's Sean, and if you haven't already heard, this is really exciting because document scanning for OneNote is finally back in Windows 10 after a long, long wait. Really quick video, this is super simple. Uh, if you open up your OneNote app, okay, this is not the desktop version of OneNote, but this is the app version of OneNote that's included with your Surface. Uh, in your OneNote page, go ahead and tap on the insert tab and you'll see the option here for camera. And when you open up the camera, you will see this little icon over here on the left hand side. By default, it's on photo, but you'll want to change that to document or whiteboard depending on what you're trying to scan. So I'm going to scan a document. Uh, now make sure, a little tip here, in your options, click on this gear icon over here. This, you only have to do this one time. Make sure that your camera settings is on 8 megapixel. That'll give you the sharpest resolution for uh, small text. I think by default it's only on 6 megapixel. So you'll want to make sure to put that on 8 megapixel. And then you can start scanning away. So let's go ahead and scan this document right over here. Oh, you can see that was an error there. Uh, let's move this a little bit of a side. Okay, so it's got that over there. That. All right, and then you can see uh, in here you just uh, discard the ones that you don't want, and then once you're happy with the documents that you do want, you can see I can zoom in here, make sure that my uh, my text looks uh, proper, and then you can go ahead and click on Insert All. And then in your OneNote, the documents that you scan should automatically show up. This is a feature that I loved and I'm so happy that it's now back in Windows 10. Uh, I use this all the time. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, uh, please like the video, share it, and thank you very much for watching.